Nice. Oops. Anyway, so we left off with the main character waking up the next morning. And um, do you know how to read this word? It is... Suddenly you got really muffled. Can you hear me, Monday? Oh, now I can. Hi. Uh oh. I read this word. Bonnie, can you hear me? I can hear you whenever you say, can I hear you? But I haven't heard you say the word that I've circled. I'm so sorry. All good. Technical problem. Uh, I can hear it the technical problem. Yep, cut the hole. What does cut the hole mean? means um means meaning one one on one side yeah one side of how a about, pair. yes how about this word this word is uh itai hi itai and last one on this page Last one on the page is Monday. Hi, Monday. Problem. Perfect. Do you know how to read this section for me? That's in the bowl. Um, doa o nukeru. Hi. Meaning, uh, to 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 grabs on the door. That's a good guess. Nukeru doesn't mean to grab, though. Tsukama means to grab. Want to have a second guess of what nukeru means? Nukeru means to lift it open. Nukeru is to go through. To go through. So right here, it says, Mezasu doa o nukeru to dare mo inae hiroma ni detta. Meaning that when I go through the door I was aiming for, I went out into a large room with no one in it. So, nukeru is to go through. And since going through isn't a destination, we use o, go through a door. It confuses me because of that kanji. Yeah. The kanjis have the hand character written on it. Mm, it does. And like tomodachi, I think. Yeah. Like friend. Hand. It's totally messed me up. Get it. Gotta you gotta dodge the hands when you're doing new get it. <laughs> new get it to go in. Slip okay. in. Slip in. So mozo mozo is a sound effect. So of course it's gonna take to. And this is a creeping sound effect, creeping about, being all ninja like, um, or squirming and restless. Mozo mozo. Um you do this for me. Hi. Uh Shinobi. Komu no mo nuketasu no no mo um tadashi? Mm, muzukashi. No, da muzukashi. Ya seki. Ya seki da. It's a. Ya shiki from mansion. Ya shiki da. It is a mansion that is difficult. Uh, to nuke nuke dasu. Um, to slip into. It is a kind of a mansion that is difficult to slip into. Shinobi mu, shinobi mu no. Shinobi koma is to slip into. Nuke dasu is not to slip into. To enter. So nuke dasu is out? actually the opposite. Yeah. So shinobi komu is to slip into. Nuke dasu is to slip out. Because nuke And then they use the word. 
They use the word no more twice. Hi. Mm. So mo means also in this context it's basically and. And you think you could use koto here. You probably could. Um, but they're using no here because they're talking about a specific mansion right here. So this specific mansion is difficult to sneak into and difficult to sneak out of is basically why they're using no. Uh, koto you could use, it'd be the act of slipping into and the act of slipping out of this of mansions are difficult would be kind of what it would start to kind of sound like. So, or perhaps he's done this multiple times, like saying, oh, it's difficult to sneak in a couple of times and sneak out a couple of times. But we're being kind of one sneaking in, that is difficult. One sneaking out is also difficult. So just doing this once is hard rather than focusing on the idea of the action or multiple occurrences of it. Hi. So... Don't worry, I, not that I hard. That. You know what mozo mozo the sound effect meant? You just told me and I forgot. Mozo mozo. It is creeping about. Kind of shuffling about, about, basically. So let's go read the lines in the book. Mozo mozo to mo fuku kara nuke dashite doa ni Mukata. I head towards the door. What did you do before out. that? So sneak out's not in here. So we do have From... Doni Mukate, which is to head towards the door. But you see, this is going after this verb. So this verb had to occur first. Nukidashite or nukidashita. So the main character, Khan, is going to nuke dasta, which is to slip out of. What do you think he's slipping out of? A door, a room? You think something's marked in the sentence that tells us? He slipped out of the mofuku, which is Ai, mofuku. the blanket, in a mozo mozo way, meaning shuffling about to get out yeah, of kinda, the blanket. Kinda, mozo, mozo. Exactly. So he gets out from underneath the blanket. And he goes toward the door. Perfect. And here's another line from the book for you to read. Beneto to neburi wa tabu shokujo da. Uje tabu was perhaps. Hi. So it say here that Benet and neburi are probably at the dining hall. Hi, hi, hi. And do you remember what this um this place they're staying at looks like? The place have two levels. So, the so. dining is on the lower floor and then the inn is on the upper floor. Perfect. Do you happen to know how to read this word? This word is Zenbu. Perfect. Meaning everything entire. Yep. Perfect. What's the negative form of iku? So to go into to not go. To not go is ikanai. Hi. Can you read this one verb that's bolded down here? I mean adjective, adverb. Adverb is hayaku. Perfect. Quickly. Quickly. What's the passive form of this guy? eat into to be eaten to be eaten is taberareru hai taberareru and you already knew that guy so now we get to go read the line from the book pekon o zenbu taberare chimau hayaku ikana ikanakia which means ika nereba, I believe. Ika nereba is ikanakia. Yep. So oh, ikanakia means you must Hi. hurry. Yaku. 
um, the bacon had already been eaten. Right, will already be eaten. And how does he feel about this idea? The bacon already eaten. Uh, he didn't like it. It was a negative. Yeah, he didn't like it. Ciao. Ciao. So that's just another example. Accidentally doesn't really work in this context. Oh no, they're gonna accidentally eat they're gonna accidentally eat the bacon. Um I'm pretty sure they did that on purpose. Towel. Um Hi. This, this is a verb we've seen in the past. Do you know how to read it? Um I forgot I struggle with this one. Hi. Um, the hard one. That's why I have it here. <laughs> we only saw it once it? more. It's kasaneru. 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 This is to pile up. Last time we saw it, this was in the letter from Brambi. When he told them that he gathered up he all of the um, magical measurements to figure out that, oh, magic is declining in Wurometo dramatically. Kasaneru. In the next part, it's the normal piling up, though, rather than the accumulate. Um, do you know how to read this bold vocabulary word? Tabe oeru is to finish eating. Perfect. And how about this right here, this little phrase from Brambi's letter? It's a Marioku no sokite o kasane. Hi. The Sokute is um measurements. Measurement. The measurement pile up. The measurement of magical power pile up. Exactly. Yep. So they piled up the measurements of the magical power. It in this case, to accumulate is a slightly better definition, but that's just because we separate those words differently than they are in um English. Um, but basically, you got all those measurements, you piled them up in front of you, and you're like, hmm, this tells me something. Okay, so now you get to go read the line from the book. Neburito Benetto wa tabe oeta sara o kasanete iru tokoro datta. Uh, Nebri and Bennett right. finished eating. Cool. They pile up the plate. Uh, they was at a point where they was piling up the plate. Perfect. Yep, they were just about to be piling up the plates of the food they uh, of the plates that they've eaten their food off of. Um, kanji tech. This guy. Um, nuke, nuke da, yep. slip out, slip out, perfect. So, slip out slip in money. uh, so it, it, it that would depend in English on the direction you're going to. So, nuke do means basically whatever the O is going there, you're basically you're outside of whatever O is marking, and you're going to be going on the other side of whatever O is marking. So, it's it could be slipping into a house. It could also be slipping out of a house. That is fully context-based. The point is that you're at one location that is not at the O, and you're ending up outside of the O, whatever O is marking. So if we say doa o nukeru, that could be going into a house, or it could be going outside of the house. It just means to go through the door. So to go through a house would insinuate you were outside of the house, you went in the house, and now you're outside of the house. So that's why it's marked by O, because it's not marking the destination. It's marking the path that you go completely through. So in the other one, it was the blanket was the path. So he went through the blanket. So in that case, it's exiting the blanket in that context. So exiting, I guess, is pretty close to what it is. Anyway, sokoneru is a do verb, and it means to miss one's chance. Well, I was suspicious. 
I don't know why these fireworks are here. I'm going to delete them. There's just bitches. Um, do slideshow. Anyway, do you know what subedu meant? This was another verb you tend to have problems with. Subedu. To soak into. Good guess. To seep it does have a water bowl. thing in here. So that's good. Good guess. That's actually um hitasu. Suberu is to slide. Or slip. To slide. Slide. Suberu. Or slip. But it's really just been using as sliding um in this book. But it does have both meanings. What is the causative form of suberu? Sube. Hey, okay, that's a good guess, but this is actually a do verb. So, causative form is saseru for do verbs. So, sube saseru. Right. Tabe saseru. Tabe saseru. Yeah. <laughs> tabe rasu. Yeah. Tabe saseru. Oh, wait. Never mind. You're right. I'm wrong. Ignore me. It was sube. It is sube raseru because this, this is not, this is a R plus U verb. I'm wrong. R plus U. Sorry. I don't, it's I don't R plus know. U. Hi. So you are correct. You are correct. Ignore everything I said two seconds ago. Good job. <laughs> Hi. Hi. And this will be our last Hi. line of the day. Let's go read the sentence. What is Khan thinking or does? Khan is Don. Um, I don't know. She got that beneath the stair. Ashi o sube rasena kara. Wow. Mm, okay, fine. Um, yo, tomaru, tomaru to neburi ga mata chiro to ore o mita. Benetto wa kochi o hiroshinai. Me Moshinai. Hmm. Oh boy. Okay. You don't want to um, think too hard. You know when children are running and then they stop suddenly? What do you how do you think they're gonna stop? Are they just gonna like stop instantly? Like boom. Or do you think they're gonna subed it? They're gonna come to a sliding stop. Hi, they're hi. gonna slide to a stop. So yeah, so he slides at the location of below the stairs. So below the stairs, so he already went down the stairs uh, before this, and now he's sliding, and then he's, while sliding, he stops. <laughs> so he's doing, in other words, he's mm. doing a sliding stop right here. So he's sliding stop, and that referred to the ashio that was slide and stop. Yep, he makes and his then feet got slide as he stops. As he stop. Then nobody, nobody got he mata meaning once again right mata hi iroto oreo mita he look at me but in what way in the churo hey. way you know it's kind of like way. i don't want to say like 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 owly oh, like he does like a blink and like what wide eye yeah kind of like oh you you really ran <laughs> Look at me wide eye and Benetto. Oh, wait, never mind. Diroto apparently Benet is a glancing look. Huh. I swear that it's like blinking. He, he looked at me glancingly huh. once again. Right. He looked at me glancing, glancingly once again. Uh, Benetto wa kochi o mimo shinai. Benet. What does Benet do? He mimoshinai, meaning he Hi. does not look? Exactly. He does not look toward me. Kochi. Kochi is the direction of whoever is talking, which is the main character. So, nobody glances at me again, but Benet doesn't glance at me. Doesn't even glance at me. So, in this case, this mo is the even meaning of mo. So, Benet doesn't, doesn't even, even glance look at me. At me. Even though Khan like did a little sliding stop. And it's like the bird with the bacon. Ah. 
And that is where Hi. we're going to stop the recording.